Rushing right out. Neo almost jumping on top of Bolts, who sets up a great quad kill. Está rolando um sorteio de 2.750 reais em skins de CSGO. Você pode até vender por dinheiro real caso ganhe. Para participar é muito simples, basta fazer o cadastro pelo link na descrição. Serão 5 vencedores de 5 facas muito lindas. Não perca a chance de levar essas belezinhas para casa. Participe, é muito fácil. Boa sorte a todos! Galera, Flash aqui, antes de começar aí o vídeo, vamos dar uma brincada aqui no Skin Hub E no meio desse anúncio aqui vai estar tá rolando um sorteio de uma conta de CS aí Então se você quiser uma conta, é, assiste esse anúncio aqui até o final Que você pode ter uma chance de ganhar o CS aí, entendeu? E pra quem não quiser ver o anúncio é só clicar no minuto que apareceu aí na tela Então galera, o Skin Hub aí disponibilizou pra nós aí 1.400 dólares pra nós dar uma brincada aqui no site é claro que eu não vou retirar nada que eu ganhei aqui, é só para mostrar para vocês como funciona. É, se você vir aqui lá em cima em Reads, Roads, Floroads, colocar o cupom Fábrica, você vai ganhar um dinheirinho no site para você abrir umas caixinhas. Então coloca o cupom Fábrica aí e bora pro vídeo, moleque. Já vou começar como? Deixa eu ver que eu vou abrir. Eu vi uma caixa muito louca aqui, uma branca, velho, cadê? Cadê essa porra? Vou começar abrindo essa caixa hall aqui. Vamos ver que vão. Nossa senhora, moleque. Vou abrir duas já, truta. Foi. Sim, porque vai vir uma hall aqui, caralho. Ah, mano, três boas de novo, velho. Se fuder, velho. O Buan enfia com essa porra de sabão aí, caralho. Galera, vamos abrir a caixa mais foda do jogo que custa 600 dólares. Vamos ver o que a gente consegue ganhar aqui. Bora. Vou guardar ela aqui. Bora abrir umas caixinhas mais baratas aqui. Pra ver o que dá. Vamos abrir essa do Pablo Escobar aqui. Vamos ver se a gente consegue uma dragão loira. Nossa, se viu uma dragão loira é mito, hein? Meu Deus, velho. Essa cara é linda, mas eu não curto não. Vamos abrir essa power, será? Vamos ver o que tem na power. Hum, essa power é boa, hein? Vamos abrir três. Pariu, velho. Galera, a gente já tá pop pra caralho aqui. Vamos abrir essa caixa, essa caixa de faca aqui. Pra ver o que dá. Vamos abrir três. Será que dá? Não, não dá. Duas. Vamos abrir duas então, caralho. Vamos ver o que vem pua. Ah, velho. Não, é. Eu acho que vou comprar a caixa. Vamos ver. Comprou o caralho. Eu paguei 240, velho. <coughs> Nossa! Esse bônus item aqui, velho, olha isso. 800, sério isso? Que veio um bônus item? Caralho, mano, vocês viram? Abri duas caixas e um bônus item de 800 dólares, velho. What the fuck, mano? Vamos aqui no inventário aqui pra ver o que, que nós tem aqui, caralho. Então, galera, eu fui lá no meu inventário lá e vendi todas as skins que eu tinha ganhado nas caixas. E você viu que profitou ali, eu tava com 1.600, agora eu tô com 2.100. E vamos torrar tudo nessa caixa luxa aqui, Luxis, Luffy, Luffy de Luffy. Então vamos lá, 3 do track dá? 3 dá, vamos ver, 4. 4 não dá, né, caralho? Vamos abrir 3, vamos ver aqui. Nossa senhora, só pra encerrar o vídeo com chave de ouro, truta. Ah, velho, acho que não paga ainda, hein. Mano, tem que vir uma Dragon Lore, truta. Tem que uma Dragon Lore. Vamos 
Tem que vir uma Dragon Lore, tem que vir uma Dragon Lore, tem que vir uma Dragon Lore. Au! Ah, velho. Que merda. Vamos torrar tudo aqui, ó. Se não vir agora, não veio. Nossa, essa é a minha faca preferida, velho. Então é isso aí, galera. Passa no SkinHub, vai ser o primeiro link na descrição. Se você usar o cupom fábrica aqui, você vai ganhar uns, umas, um dinheirinho aí pra dar umas abridas nas caixas. Beleza? Então, galera, sobre o sorteio da conta de CSGO. É muito simples, você vai comentar aí embaixo aí, hashtag FDP100K E quando esse vídeo aqui pegar 4 mil likes, sim, 4 mil likes, eu vou fixar aí o ganhador Eu vou dar, vou estar tá sorteando aí o ganhador e vai estar tá fixado aqui nos comentários Então sempre dá uma olhada aqui no vídeo pra ver se pegou 4 mil Porque assim que pegar 4 mil likes, eu, já vai ter alguém fixado aí que ganhou o sorteio, beleza? É, e é isso aí então, comenta aí, hashtag FDP100K Bora passar aqui no Skin Hub, usar nosso cupom que vai ajudar bastante a gente Beleza? Tamo junto, bora pro vídeo. In a lot of trouble here, alone, there's no one there with him, and he's gonna go down, Pasha, very aggressive and snacks. One headshot here could do wonders, he's forced back a little bit, and Fur wants to try and see if he can maybe chase him down. Bolts is there as well, snacks in the corner, and that's a great double kill in return. That's actually huge. Snacks just couldn't get away, couldn't feel comfortable. Taz has to hold the line, has to hold the bomb site, and he can't land that shot, and they all fall down. Aggressive pistol round from SK, and they've got it. 1-0. Very interesting, and trying to respond to losing that control over at long. Plenty of time. The bomb is still dropped pretty far back here. Do Virtus Pro want to try and retake it? I think they may have heard the drop already, so cold. And SMG around the corner, going to get shut down. Pasha with the second kill. And Fur in the corner, he's been spotted as well. A very, very good start here, and Snacks taking down Bolt will fall right afterwards. Yeah, they're going to want to keep their eye on that AWP, though. You definitely want to salvage that if you're Virtus Pro. Taz not going for it quite yet, obviously not realizing, not knowing if they still have the angle covered. He's the only one over at the A bomb site. He's not even really in the site as well. He's got to be careful. There are two smokes fallen in fur, and if those get put up at the right time in the right place, they could be blocked off and have to fight their way into a retake. But look at the info Neo is gaining on the flank. Yeah, this is very good stuff. Should be almost unwinnable. He's making a bit too much noise coming in. Gotta be very careful. Shooting him in the back, though. It's obviously great news here for Neo and Viali to close out that round. So Virtus Pro winning the first rifle round. And it looks like it's gonna be a very explosive round here. This is classic cobblestone. Jumping down through the smoke. Mac 10 leading the charge. Fur is already down and Taco is gonna fall. The defense holds. Viali with a kill on Cold Sierra. Fallen, unable to get the flick and Pasha will drop him. Now it's Bolt, one versus four. He needs the damage, a couple of kills, but Pasha shutting it down. It's a triple here. Much, much longer. Taz and Snacks have to hold off as long as possible. Flashbangs coming out, slowing SK just a little bit. Now they're up the ramp. There's Bialy with one. The Molotov is gonna do some damage. The Deagle's gonna finish off Snacks. And Cold is trying to do everything he can. And don't underestimate him. He's gonna get one more kill. Taking down Taz, and he's finally gonna get zoned out. Pasha coming in with a big kill there. And Bolts, the problem here is there's only 15 seconds. The bomb has to be picked up right now. And he's going to get zoned out by Neo, who was on a very long rotation. So, very, very close. Cold Zero, all of a flashbang, trying to bait someone in to take the peak. 50 seconds now. And SK making the way down drop. There's the smoke to come up. Fur with a great headshot to shut down Bialy Pasha. Getting one in return. They have to get this round. SK Gaming, leg shot comes through. Neo gets one. A great double kill. Pistols out. But he can't make it work. They've done so much damage already, Virtus Pro. And Snacks now showing up with the AWP. Taz on the side. It looks like SK want to boost up onto the box in the middle to get that high ground advantage. Snacks sees it coming. And now it's unfallen. One versus two. 25 seconds here. He's on the site. No bomb plant yet. Taz is just baiting him out. Snacks is waiting on the other side. The clock is running down low. Fallen is going to go down. Taz with a really good kill. He's already up long A. This is going to be so dangerous. Flash over towards B platform. Bialy's going to push it. They're taking matters into their own hands. That's brilliant. And Pasha saving Bialy as well. This teamwork is so impressive. Bolts is still on the flight, though. Still some danger. Snacks is ready for him, but misses the shot. 20 seconds left. The bomb can't even make it. Taz cuts him off. VP is everywhere across this map. Oh my god. I. I was not expecting that. It looked like SK had the lineup, but the fact that they go that aggressive, Taco not ready for it, Pasha saving. They only have two left as well, SK. 
that Pasha to deal with. Plenty of flashbangs. One comes out now, and he's blind. He almost even hits the shot. There's Neo from drop. When does Fur come down? When does he apply pressure to drop zone? Bolts gets a kill. That's on Biali. Pasha smoked out. He can see absolutely nothing. It's all on Neo. Instant headshot onto Cold Zera. It's Bolts up next, and he gets one more. And they still can't find their way into the bomb site. This is a very slow hit, but Virtus Pro, they're holding it for now. Neo getting close, running headshot, takes another one, and almost drops Fallen. Fur, who's been lurking the whole round, has to come up big here. It's a two on two. Fallen did finally take Pasha down, but there's only 10 seconds left. They need this round. They must win in this cave. They can't make this work. This whole first half is going to be washed away by Virtus Pro, and there's Neo coming through with a big kill, a quad, in fact. As Virtus Pro win it, SK must know. For the site, one HE need left in their arsenal as well. They're gonna have to fight their way in because as their VP is here, but Pasha gets caught with a nade in his hands, and that's two kills from Fur. Taz is the only one left. He's down to 48 HP. They haven't seen him yet though, but Cold Zera is coming to the balcony, and Fur's gonna check it anyways. Yeah. That's beautiful stuff. Yeah, double peaked in fact from, from low ground and the balcony. I think BP is going to be out of money, perhaps. I think they've been drawn down enough. I think they've been whittled away. But that would be an interesting change of, change of pace. That would mean finally SK could get some breathing room here in the first half. They've definitely been suffocated quite a bit by Virtus Pro's defense. Neo will get the one kill. Saving the AWP is probably a very good idea, considering that you only have five health left that opening kill on the CT side, you can afford to be a bit more defensive, but that's just not the style that VP are employing. They want to keep it up. Snacks here, and he's going to get knocked out by Bolts. Not many people win that fight against Snacks. That's a big fight. Neo's already on the flank, though. He's already pushed up so far. He's going to continue forward, especially now that that kill's there. Taz has got to take out Bolts. He's got to win this fight, and he does. That's going to delay them. That can buy them time. Flashbang over the wall, that's not bad, but he does get taken out. Not ready for Fur to be there. Again, Fur overly aggressive, and VP's not ready for it. Same with Pasha, and that neutralizes the flank of Neo coming in. And they obviously know it. Fallen with a great kill. Shutting down Neo, reading it very well. Oh my god, the bomb is out towards A, but this is very fast towards the B bomb site. Flashbang comes a little bit late, but... Pasha has spotted Taco, his second one blinds him completely. They don't want that fight, they pulled the rotation. They need to make this work. They need to hustle back to the A bomb site if that's the plan. Neo's gonna drop down, he's there to cut off some rotations. Oh! Oh my word, that's so quick to come through. One player fallen, he's down next. And they have the A bomb site. Neo's cracked it open. There's absolutely no way. Taz gets down finally, but I'm not even sure what we just witnessed. Three. On four, as Taco gets a great kill there, bringing it back to a three on three. Bomb plant finally going through. I still feel shell shock from that. Taco getting one more great kill, taking down Snacks, trying to fight it back and shake off the shock that just was Neo, who's still alive and pushing closer. He's got the double, he wants to take bolts as well, and the time is perfect. Turning around and spots Cold Zero up on the high ground. Ooh. Neo looking for the ace, but he's gonna get taken out, and now it's cold. Versus Bialy, one on one here for the pistol. Glock versus USP. Colt making the jump. Bialy spots it. Gonna try and fall oh. back. He gets a fadeaway headshot. Bialy taking down Cold Sierra, and that is gonna put it miles ahead. Smokestack. It almost seems like it. Yes, indeed. What do they do with it? That's the question. So versatile. They've pulled away Fur from that A bomb site. Well, not all the way. They've pulled them just to the double doors. Still haven't pounced anywhere, and it's going to be a split. These guys want to attack drop, and Bolts isn't ready for it. The timing, there's the boost up. Is he ready for that? Yes, he is. Bialy goes down, and now Snacks has to go elsewhere, and this is where Fur pounces. He's traded off. Are they aware of Fallen over towards A halls? Now it looks like they changed their mind. They want to go towards B, and nothing is working. They just haven't had enough success, and that might be the dagger. Snacks is now in a one on two. At least he spots out where Cold is, and they definitely got the call about Fallen with that AWP. Still very hard to get the bomb down eventually. That's all SK have to play for right now. Just make sure that you force him to at least attempt the bomb at some point. Time is going to be running out. There's 40 seconds now. Cold in the corner. Snacks. Not easy to check at all. He's got to worry about a hundred different angles here. Tries to see if he could do it, walking out with his back turned, and that's the round. SK pick it up. Very, very good adjustment to crush that split on A, which was a very good round to be everything for this defense. Cold playing inside of the smoke, really good angle. Bolts there, and Cold Zero knocking out two players. 
That's the kind of start they need. And Cold again. Triple now for him, leaving Pasha. AWP, so he's got to be a bit careful. Oh, and he sees everybody. He's smoked out almost immediately. This could actually be a really big problem. Fur has to come up big, lining him up, but he gets knocked down. Snacks with the kill. Fallen going down. Neo with that one. Three versus five now. And they can't let go of this one. Bolts is out as well. Cold Zero very exposed. And somehow he's still alive. The bomb will be planted, but Cold is doing even more work. Asha's got the position with the AWPs at the bottom of the ramp in mid. Taco is going to have a very tough time getting out. He's got a smoke, and that's what he's going to use to get out. But does he turn to his right to take the fight? He has done a great job getting in this position, and they have all post-plant spots to win it. And they have to win it. Taco making his way in. Pasha missing a huge kill, but cold. He had solo health. He's going to go down, and Taco might not have a chance any longer. He's going to... Slide back out. It's dangerous. If they smoke this off and just book it up mid... Oh my god, that timing. That's so harsh. Wow. Let's see if that is going to cost SK Gaming. Now they're getting very close. Fallen right on the ledge. And they're ready for it. He misses the shot. And now he just has to run. They've got him trapped in the corner. Cold picking up a shot and Fallen trying to stay alive. But won't make it happen. Bolts goes down to Pasha. This is big. Four versus three. 25 seconds, Cold Sierra looking for an opening. He wants back in the site, but they're not going to let him that smoke. Can Fur bring it back? He's gone undiscovered over at Long. Taco as well is on the flank. This could be very tricky for Virtus Pro to spite a man advantage. It's all on the line. Big investment in this round for the Brazilians. Viali holding close here. Fur going to go for the peak, and he gets shut down immediately. Cold Zero and Taco left, two on four, and they just want to make it back. Taco with a big double opening, bringing down Taz and Pasha. But there's not that much time left. The bomb has been planted for a long time already. Cold, he needs this fight against Neo, and he finally gets the headshot. And Bialy, can he save it one more time? He's going to go for the defuser, and Bialy gets the kill. And that's almost the last kill coming in. Bialy, he got dropped, but the bomb is going to take Cold Zero with him. And another round. The classic, the overpowering play. Cold Zero is with the off, but he hits one. Can he get any more? He's gonna drop the smoke to his left, peek out to the right. Looking, looking, Bialy's gotta kill meanwhile. He's gotta do it now. He's forced into the flames and he gets one more. He's holding on as long as he possibly can. The bomb is getting planted. What a sacrifice from Cold, taking all that damage. Still alive and fallen, getting the shot on Taz. Bialy and Neo trying to stay alive. And now just Neo, one versus four and the bomb not gonna go up this round Looking dead into the smoke pulling the trigger now would be wonderful and they're trying to boost to look on top of it cold repositioning himself can he see anybody not just yet and here comes the push taco getting the first kill taking out neo that's a really big effort dropping a second and nearly a third taz finally overcoming him and now cold zero in a bit of trouble behind the statue flashbang serini drops Bialy. in fact fallen there coming out the defense is holding SK surviving this round. Seven seconds as Fallen shows up as the hero. And wants to put up the smoke. The Molotov, in fact, to try and force them back. Ooh, Fallen missing one shot. Goes for the repeat. Now they're going to try and grenade everything here. And Fur has to get at least one kill and preferably stay alive for quite a long time. I think that was a friendly flashbang. Fur getting the kill on Snacks, dropping the bomb. This is big news here. SK Gaming fighting for their lives. Fallen gonna burn to the Molotov. Fur is down as well. Pasha getting the kill. But Bolt Bolts is gonna come in as well. Three on three. Bolts shot in the face. Taz now in play. And Taco, he's very exposed here. Gonna get shut down. Neo just walking in casually. Cold Sierra. One versus three. It is looking like tournament point here for Virtus Pro. They've got plenty of time. Cold Sierra sneaking in, getting Bialy. Surely not. That's let the bomb cross, though. That was something that could have helped. Cold Zero with the op now. He's got to find two. He's got to find his one on ones, and he has no idea where the second player is. Behind the trunk. One missed shot, and it's going to be a headshot from Taz. So quick. But Fallen's got a big job to do again. Oh, he's pushed up against them. He gets the first shot on Taz. That's almost unbelievable. Going to fall back into the site behind the cannons. He cannot miss this next shot. Snacks is right in front, Ooh. a headshot from Fallen, he wants more, the triple, trying to get the no-scope, but he cannot get it. Neo has taken him down, 14 seconds, and trying for the bomb plant. Two on three, Neo and Pasha, holding on to the dream. Otherwise, SK Gaming could be right back in this game. And their heads have got to be spinning right now. The pulse rushing in their ears, Neo on the site. 
They've got him isolated. There's a deep flank coming in here from Pasha. He goes down. Neo, the last one left. He's going to get one kill turning around and he gets shot down. Going all 30 rounds here against SK Gaming. That is so close. Fallen delivers. So it doesn't seem like they'll be able to... Yeah, they're just going to execute here. And this is a clever smoke from Taco. He'll be able to utilize that pretty well. He can hide in it. He can walk around the edges. And Molotov for Cold Zera. He's going to burn. He's going to drop that smoke. Here come the UMPs. Rushing right out. Neo almost jumping on top of Bolts, who sets up a great quad kill, spraying down every single member, and that's overtime. 15-15. Worrying if you're SK that the pace can just be picked up whenever. And it seems like BP really realized this hall's portion of the map. And they can just take out Fur. He's going to turn the corner. That's the bomb. Neo's going to come in for the trade. The spam, and he can't win that one either. Pasha has just been holding for a peek, but it's just been Fur all on his own. So VP is going to have to fight their way into this bomb site. The timing's not there. Fur drops three in this round, and there's no utility that they can use. Snacks with one. As he works his way up to the top, but there's still two players here. The op from Fallen, it's not going to miss that shot. Now he spotted out Snacks as well, and it's an easy kill for Bolts, who snuck over by cannons. Oh, look at Taz, aggressive. Timing could have been there, but now this A bomb site is in so much trouble. And with 30 seconds left, they are going to make a run for it, SK Gaming. They want to get up close before too much aggression comes in from the BP side. And in fact, they're a little bit slow, which has allowed Virtus Pro to get closer. Snacks unscoping at the wrong time, and he's in trouble. Gets the damage, but every single teammate has fallen, and he's going to get dropped. Neo was miles away, so. It looked like maybe SK were waiting too long. Overtime is now in effect. Fur turning around and Taz, did he not see it? Neo gets a kill, but first running down Taz, so... It's Bialy read this though, and again, look at Cold Zera. Who better to lurk in this position? All he has to do is get one kill. Bialy has to watch this, and he's gonna find it, he's gonna get the kill. Now it's on Snacks next. Bolts is gonna turn the corner, and he's gonna win the fight. He's down low, but another flashbang goes down. And SK, they might have just done it. Five seconds left of the clock. Gonna get the bomb plant down, there's no grenade to stop it, otherwise that could have been ugly. They're very low on health right now. But VP, can they make it past that AWP? It's on fur now, in fact. Neo trying for the peak, there's the first kill. Unreturned from SK Gaming. And he really wants to see if he can get this done. Bolt's going for yet another kill. Almost out of it, and first to get the shot with the AWP, SK Gaming! So that's just SK being much smarter about it, but here's that iconic shotgun from Snacks. Bolts won this fight earlier, and it's the same exact way. He does it again. Starting to believe that Bolts just might be a genius. <laughs> Not many players are going to be able to win that fight, and he's done it twice now. It Ta double over time. Taz has a flashbang as well if he wants to do that, but he misses the shots. Now here's Bialy. He's got to get two. He's dig fur. He's going to go for Taco. It's not going to happen. Two on three situation. Neo and Pasha are going to rotate over. They're going to be here in time. They need to be quick, they have to get this next kill. Neo almost caught out, Bolt's getting more kills. Another double for him, and there's the triple, the headshot. He... A lot of pressure on this B defense. No hit yet, here they come down, drop. Bialy's here, can't win that initial fight. Now it gets scary, Taz underneath the window. He gets one, Taco doesn't want to mess with it. Well, that's a big kill, Cold Sierra getting one on the bomb side itself. Pasha locked in. They don't even have the bomb committed to this yet. Cold is just looking for a way. And he sees the gun barrel, Pasha in so much trouble, he's going to drop, and Snacks. I'm not sure there's any way to retake this. Picks up the M4, and he's going to get down by Fallen, three in a row here. SK Gaming now, it's... They're still so far away, they're not even making a presence at this bomb site. This could be, they're using a lot of utility, and not doing anything with it. Cold, getting the first kill, a lot of people coming down, drop making a lot of noise here. They've already lost Pasha. There's Bolts with a kill. Can he close it out? He's going to be going down to Bayali. Taco comes in with a spray. Somehow Taz gets a one in return. Now they want to run for the site. Fallen is here, shutting down Neo. Bialy and Taz left two on three. 30 seconds. They have to make a move. The falling, missing a shot, but Fur is there to follow it up. And Taz, the last one left. SK Gaming, miraculous comeback here in Russia. They win the whole tournament. Time and time again! You can't mess with this team. You can't doubt them in any scenario. The comeback on train was...
Don't have to search for more I'll give you what you need What are you waiting for? I'm right beside you tearing on your sleeve A friend of mine There's no use resisting me Believe